Make sure you check out our new sponsor, the Health Blaze. All the information is in the description. Use the promo code above. Good filler one boxing at 18% off of all their natural products from deodorant, pomade, toothpaste, and much, much more. And they have additional discounts on their website as well. That's the healthblaze.com. Start December 20th. That promo code is good for 18% off. We go. Here goes Oscar De La Hoya with some more cloud chase when it comes to Floyd Mayweather Jr. Once again, he says that a potential Canelo fight with Floyd Mayweather can generate $1.5 billion. Let's talk about Oscar De La Hoya uh, claim. Uh, he did an uh, interview with TMZ, but I'll link the box, boxing scene article in the description. Uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, bell icon button. Don't forget to check out our sponsor, The Hellblaze at TheHellblaze.com. Promo code GOODFELLA1 boxing gets you 18% off their all natural products from lotion soaps, foot soaps, bath bombs, deodorant, toothpaste, hair pomade, and much, much more. Website, promo code are in the description, and we will be doing a giveaway real soon. And don't forget to check out our Patreon, Raw and Censor, Uncut, Boxing Talk, the way I can't talk on YouTube. That link's in the description as well. But, um, yeah, old, uh, old Dust, Dust Nose Boy, Oscar De La Hoya. You know, he says, first of all, Floyd is retired, so there's no fight to make. But if Floyd did want to come back, he should stop fighting fighters who are two-way two -way division smaller than him. If Floyd Mayweather decides to come back, a fight with him and Canelo would, uh, could be a $1.5 billion fight. Oscar tells TMZ. Um, and that's what he said. He said, you know, Canelo, you know, before he would love to avenge his loss to Floyd and all that. Look here, man. At the end of the day, we got problems here. We got problems. You want Floyd to to move up when Canelo fucking super mid was fighting that super middleweight. For two, um, you could say the fight generated whatever, but the fight ain't going on on the zone, though. The zone had to pay Floyd a billion dollars to put the fight on the zone. You know what I'm saying? They got to get him the, a billion dollars to put the fight on his own. You know, at the end of the day, you know, he's not going to help launch him and boost, you know, um, the zone. That's exactly what they want him to do. I see the La Hoya, Eddie Hearn, all them clowns know the zone is in trouble. No matter if they got Joshua, Danny Jacobs, Canelo Alvarez, Triple G, snow colorful personalities that's going to draw the average American to the zone. I'm telling you that right now. It ain't an Ali. It ain't a monster puncher over there like Foreman. It, it ain't nobody like that. Mike Tyson, nobody over there can drive the casual public to the zone. They're doing a horrible job promoting the zone. You know what I'm saying? So now what they're doing now is Oscar and Eddie Hearn is getting desperate. They're throwing Hail Marys because if the zone shut down, ain't, no, ain't going to be nowhere else to go. By the time they come back, even though Steven Espinosa – Love putting his nose up uh, uh, Anthony Joshua Fury, but he'll love to have Canelo Alvarez. He'll get Canelo a deal, you know, but he won't get Wilder a deal. He, I mean, they have a place to go, you know what I'm saying? They most definitely will, you know, but do they want to come back and work with Showtime? I think not. So they probably go to ESPN by the time, you know, this zone shit shut down. If it do shut down, I'm going to say, you know, Showtime probably not going to be in boxing. You're going to probably have... Uh, Fox PVC on the whole thing, and then you might have NBC jump in there and try to cut carry the rest of the load. You know what I'm saying? Um, because I heard they may be losing NFL uh, Sunday Night Football to ABC. So uh, ESPN with Walt Disney trying to get both of ESPN Monday Night Football, Sunday and Monday Night Football. But you know, like I said before, you know, let Floyd be. You know, he need to stop fighting. What 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 is concern? What he doing? What is concern? What he doing? You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody saying Oscar De La Hoya need to stop, you know, uh, uh, you know, dressing in drag and putting fishnets on and, you know, uh, you know, bending over and playing with kitchen utensils. Ain't nobody care what Oscar De La Hoya doing. Stop worrying about what the next dude doing. And all this is is a is a is a uh, clout chase to say the zone. They know they're in trouble. They know they're in trouble. You say, well, this can do this. You know, this is this fight gonna be on Mayweather turns probably gonna be on Showtime, especially in the position Showtime in is declining. You know, and Oscar De La Hoya is just, you know, he sent the, uh, the cease and desist letter for Floyd Mayweather for messing with for Ryan Garcia. He's a very insecure dude. These boxers are very insecure, man. They very feminine like, man. You, 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 you crying because I, uh, Ryan Garcia went to the tank fight. You crying because he went to Floyd Mayweather birthday party. 
Oh, you fly, you crying because Mayweather made him an offer. He beat Rowley 200000 You know what I'm saying? Control your fighters, Oscar. You know what I'm saying? And then you trying to sit here and you're going to try to tell Ryan Garcia not to go mess with Floyd, but you calling out Floyd for Canelo. Floyd, Floyd is, is hella big. You know what I'm saying? Floyd, I mean, uh, Canelo is hella big. You know what I'm saying? Now all of a sudden they want to call Floyd out 10 fucking years later or several, several fucking years later. Oh, let's call Canelo. Let's call Floyd out right now. And yeah, we desperate. Nah, why don't you go over there and do what you got to do? You know, just handle business. But like I said before, the Mexicans are going with what they trying to, and the Eastern European fans, I don't know why they why they believe in Eastern Europeans so much. You know, these are the these are the people they target to push their app. And like I said before, the black dollar spends the most money, and it's a boxing and acknowledges and caters to the black fight fans. Boxing is not going to prosper the way it is. Into it caters to the white fight fan. It won't prosper neither. You know, they're not, they not white fight fan or black fight fan friendly. I've been saying that. People say, well, Mexicans, you know, they spend you spend a lot of money. Yeah, because yeah, everything in boxing is catered towards them. But if they if they, they promoted the brothers like Fox promoted Earl, if they, they continue to pro, promote the brothers and they put the brothers on the pedestal, I'm telling you, man, if they can fight, fight and really promote Caleb Plant, as a good white American boy from Tennessee, man, man, the PBC has shut the game down. But they don't believe in their fighters like that. They don't promote their black fighters like that. They're doing the same thing Oscar doing with Canelo. You know, Al Heyman got Santa Cruz and a few other guys. You know, they're not going they not going they not going to do that. You know, that's why Deontay Wilder could walk around here without a fight deal. And Anthony Joshua had a several fight deal with Showtime. But all I'm saying is this to close it out with Canelo and Oscar De La Hoya. Cane- Oscar De La Hoya, I think Oscar De La Hoya really want to uh, get Floyd in a secret hotel room and just and just love him down. You know what I'm saying? Like he ready for the world. He really he really want to you know lick the top of Floyd's chocolate head and, and, and massage and stuff like that. He really want to tie Floyd to them beds. He be in them hotel rooms, you know, doing what Jesus Christ don't want him to do. He want to go ham on Floyd. That's what he come down to. Oscar De La Hoya is sexually attracted to Floyd Mayweather. That's just the only th- way it can be. You know, if Floyd Mayweather, you know, better watch out what he drinking and where he going at in Vegas because Oscar De La Hoya might pick him off a street corner, drag him out the club, and, and take him to the uh, MGM Grand and dog walk him. <laughs> you know, that's just this what it, it boiled down to, man. You know, and one thing, another thing about – um. About that fight with Floyd and Canelo, man. I mean, Canelo got dog walk. Canelo didn't win around, man. You know, you won't. And you, and, and, what, 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 what's your Floyd Mayweather fight Canelo for? Canelo didn't get around. And Oscar De La Hoya abandoned Canelo in a time of need. Remember, he was talking all that how Canelo's gonna be Floyd. And then right before the fight, he entered the rehab. Come out of here. You know what I'm saying? This dude beat Floyd. I mean, Floyd beat this dude every round. You know what I'm saying? And you need to move on, man. Now you moving that middleweight, super middleweight, and now you want to call out Floyd and fuck up out of here. Ain't nobody trying to say yo the zone. Ain't nobody, ain't no brother about to come over there and say the zone. You know that's what they want. They want Floyd to come over there and launch their platform. And if I'm Floyd, I better get a billion in cash off rip. You know, cause you y'all gonna make at least a billion and a half. You say, and Canelo get the half. That's it. Cause I'm launching y'all platform. I'm doing what he can't. Like I said before, Canelo doing a horrible job launching the platform because your average American don't care about Canelo. Canelo ain't no ain't no ain't no superstar in our sports world. He ain't LeBron. He ain't Westbrook. He ain't you know Tom Brady. And he ain't he ain't none of them. He ain't Bryce Harper. He ain't no superstar in our sports world. That's what people don't understand. That's why boxing can't progress. You know what I'm saying? Because they keep putting their money into Mexican fighters. They keep putting their money. And to these Eastern European fighters and these, these fighters that don't sell. We want to hear English. We want controversy. There ain't nothing controversial other than Canelo cheating. Other than that, you know. We want to hear people talk that talk. And you can't talk that talk when you only speak Spanish and broken English. You know, but that's something to think about, man. But uh, good fellow sports TV. Don't forget we on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. You can reach out to the email if you got business questions, inquiry, responsibility, or you just want to chop it up in addition to that. Continue to share to share the videos, man. Don't forget to check out our sponsor, the Hellblazer, 
Promo code good for the one box and get you 18% off their all natural products from soaps, lotions, foot soaps, bath bombs, deodorant, toothpaste, hair pomade, and much, much more. Um, check them out, man. You won't be mad. Website promo code are in the description. Check out the Hellblaze. Um, and uh, just keep looking out for us, man. If you want to make a donation, that link's always there. Continue to share the videos. Don't forget to check out the Patreon. It's your boy.